Hola, me llamo Cindy. Hola, me pagué. Hola. Me amo. Pues que... Oh, como está? Me amo, me dicen. Thanks for watching Inspiring Change by Cindy. Hello, today we cleaned up my our mom's car and it was a mess because we go on a lot of road trips. So first we started off with the junk. We all <laughs> her car is a mess. And also those back seats were a mess because we have a German shepherd. And we took him to a dog park and it started raining, so he got all muddy. And oh, he yeah. sat in the back seat, so it's just disgusting. I'm glad he did. It'd be better than on mommy's face. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so yes, the car is a mess. However, we clean it up. All of it. And we should clean it up. We made the mess. You thought it would take like 12. It would be done in minus 12 minutes, under 12 minutes. And minus 12 minutes. <laughs> and then it took us three whole hours. Right now, we're just doing the trunk. Just emptying it out, taking out some of my mom's, some of my mom's school stuff. And any other stuff in there. My, these are all... <laughs> okay, not all that. This is all math manipulatives that fell all over the back of my car. A blonde wig. That I wear. No questions asked. A bunch of and, random bottles of water. <laughs> oh my gosh, water. I don't even know what happened to this trunk. All I know is I was transporting math manipulatives from one school to the next from my ASD unit and somehow it ended up spilling all over everywhere. So that's what Lil is doing. He's picking up all mm. those little math pieces. Do you know what ASD means? I don't know. What is it? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Think. ASD is ASD. Autism spectrum. Autism spectrum. Disorder. Disorder. Okay. Right now, I was just clearing out the back seats because there was a bunch of water bottles and chargers and stuff like that. Then we moved on to the front half of the car. Look how fast. We're already done emptying out the back, the trunk. Oh my speed. That was the easiest part. I agree. I concur. What does that mean? I agree. Okay. Well, why do you say concur instead of I agree? Switching it up. Okay. Expanding your vocabulary, son. I don't want to learn a vocabulary. Well, you just did. Oh, no. You're welcome. Thank you. Yes. Right here, we we're just doing doing the blower, which gets inside all the little cracks that vacuums, like hand vacuums and stuff, can't get. Just sort of blows everything out. As soon as the car is blowed out and all the dust is out and everything's out from in between the cracks, then finally we could get ready to wash the car the exterior start from the outside it looked really good at the end it then we're almost done with the inside look at how beautiful those clouds look yep you can literally see them moving we're going so fast I know. I've seen them move that fast in real life. They have? Mm-hmm. They can teleport. 
That's our neighbor Connor. He helped us with the pond that we once cleaned. And, and built. built. And built. <laughs> so right now we are starting with just rinsing the outside with our hose. And we got very soaked doing this. Well, I got the most soaked. I yeah, Leo took ba a bath. That's later in the video. I love the soap that I'm using because it smells divine. It just, it smells really, really delicious. I don't know how to explain it. It's also um, organic, so it doesn't make, it doesn't dry out my hands too much. Lavender smells delicious? Wow, lavender's delicious! It is delicious. It is. I'm <laughs> right now, I'm cleaning the tire with the spray. I'm just putting it on. But it's really low down, so you have to like go down. There is the spray, it's called a rim spray. You're supposed to spray every single thing, and when you wash it off with water, it's, it smells good. It does smell good. Um, yeah, you spray it all over the rims, the brakes, the rotors, a little bit on the tires, and you just let it sit. And after it sits for a little bit, well, I like how you went through with the rag and cleaned it off. After you let it sit for a little bit, then you just rinse it off. So here was when I was spraying and I soaked Lale. You s <laughs> There you go. Up close and personal. Yep. <laughs> she sprayed me all around. I'm glad I got on my Crocs. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Now you're just trying to get wet. Barefoot, yeah, yeah. I remember I went straight in front of the hose. So we clean the car good with the soap. It smells good too. My hands feel really soft. I think we did a really good job, guys. Thanks for that. Your help. You're and welcome. thank you. <laughs> and once we clean it off, what do we do next? Well, we use the ShamWow or the Shammy because it's sort of like a rag, but it soaks it up really good. So we just dried it so it didn't leave any streaks or circles or anything on the Oh, car. those like watermarks that it leaves. Yeah, so we went around and we dried it. Actually, um, while I was drying the car, you went around and cleaned all the windows with that window spray. Yep. Right now, I, I sat in there because I was Thank trying to get clean. I see you poured some water bottles in there. Yeah. That That's was the really fun. container with water and soap that we dipped the rags in when we were cleaning Look the at car. this. And then Look I at this. Watch this perfection. Wait a minute. I caught you folding up. I caught you. Yes. Now you just gotta do this with your laundry. No! I caught you doing folding of a towel to perfection. <laughs> Wait, are we waxing already? Yeah, I think so. This is when we wax the car, which I love the wax because it makes it super shiny. I know it does. Okay, so here's what we did. It's so easy. So first we washed the car, then we dried it. We cleaned the windows. For the wax, you have to do it on a dry, clean car. It has to be dry and it has to be clean. You spray it, wax on, wax off. And then? Think about Mr. Miyagi. Wax on, wax off. While I was in there, at the end, my mom pretty much made me take a shower. She soaked me with the hose, my hair and everything, and then it counted it as a shower, so. I'm gonna do this every day now. The wax took a long time because you have to do small parts at a time. You can't spray the entire car and then do it. Yeah, you have you do have to do tiny sections at a time, but it makes such a difference. Well, she's taking a bath. Waiting. Oh, Here's look at when you I being dried nice. it with my towel. You're so nice. This was sort of the after of the outside of the car. It looks super shiny. 
and you could just see it in the filming how shiny and smooth it was. The wax is my favorite part to do on a car because I feel like it protects it from the weather, the rain, the heat, the bugs. The it takes a yeah, it takes a little bit of extra um, energy in addition to washing it, but next time it rains, it's like the car gets a car wash all over again. Now we went on to the interior cleaning. So we just have our spray and a rag and we're just sort of wiping down the seats because the leather spray doesn't clean it. It's more so just like an after thing. Yeah, this spray is the antibacterial because we have to scrub. We have to scrub it, literally scrub it out before even putting leather conditioner. It was so dirty from from Hands. life Hands. forever from life. Scrub, 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 scrub. I love this brush because it allows you to get into the cracks and get all of the things that just a rag won't get. You, you did really good on doing it. Thank you. That was very nice of you. So once I scrub it, then I spray it down again and then wipe it off one last time with the rag because, and this is just a disinfectant. I haven't even started on the leather. cracks are clean from the scrubby brush. The corners, the cracks, yeah. Everything. Um, this is in between the chair when you recline it. Yeah. And this is the difference between cleaning a car and detailing a car. Yeah. Yeah. You can see how dirty it is from like spilled stuff. That's what this brush really helps with. It really scrubs it. See, you won't even see this though unless you recline your chairs. This is why when you detail, you have to pay attention to everything. You have to pay attention. This took this took multiple attempts actually. It's a little better. A little. This looks like the back seats because it is so dirty. It was filthy. But the dog park was fun. The dogs had a great time and the rain came super fast. Oh, you can see how dirty it is. So we didn't use the sponges I love the sponges because when you put them in cold water, they get harder. And when you put them in hot water, they get a lot softer. Yeah, so you can determine. We use both sides. We needed the hard scrub and the soft scrub. Yeah. And the rag. And the brush. Yep. Yep. Okay, so finally, now that everything is disinfected and scrubbed with the, with the scrub, the brush, the rags, now I think this is when we clean the... we're cleaning the edges, right? In between the cracks oh, yeah. of the door where it doesn't get when you wash it. We definitely did good on that. I think you were inside at this time. I was? Yeah. You really only did the outside and then the picking up at the inside. Yeah. Okay, so here you are. This part was satisfying. There's a part that was satisfying. What I'm doing now is really satisfying because there was like black, dirty lines. 
And when he wiped it off, it just sort of got off. You won't see these lines, though, unless the doors are open. Yep. This is something a car wash doesn't get. Or even the vacuum. No. See, and you, like, literally have to get down there just to even know that this is dirty. But what a difference it makes when you clean it off. You can see the black line there. That's I haven't even gotten to it yet. It's like dirt and oil and stuff. And again, this is the difference between cleaning a car and detailing a car. And this is after we've done the outside. Can we detail or clean? Detailed. Well, we did it right. Yeah, we Here's what I was talking about, a close-up, how dirty, that's not part of the car, that is like dirt and filth. That's called elbow grease right there, guys. Oh, when you have to scrub it out. I don't even want to know what that's called and why it's called that. There you, you have go. to really use your arms and your elbows to scrub it Watch. out. Watch, there's the before. Scrub, scrub, scrub. If this didn't work, then I would have brought the brush to it, oh, but it did work because we saturated it. After, it didn't get fully off because it's been no, sitting there yeah. for years. Oh, well, I'm going to keep working on this, though. Of it off. Also, this part is important because you could see. You could see it when you open the door, and unfortunately, when you wash the outside, it just doesn't get it. Yes. A lot of people, when they're detailing their car, forget a lot of the little details they need to do. Oh. Uh. Our dad got home. On his Harley Davidson motorcycle. Oh. Uh, guys, when you're detailing the car, don't forget to run some of those rags through the engine. Make sure not to burn yourself. Let the engine cool down first. Oh, what is this spray called? What you're doing is the armor all. What I'm doing is the leather conditioner. But I didn't want us to use armor all or leather conditioner until we cleaned first. This way I could just work the conditioner into the leather and you could just work the armor all into everything that's black in there and shine it up. So you could really see like the before and after from the armor all where that's basically for the black surfaces. So yeah, you can see up there on the on the leather too, because um I could tell the difference, like it's moisturized once I put that conditioner in there. Oh, what about this? So cars have conditioners? Leather like conditioner. Yeah. Pretty much, yeah. What's this right here? This was the air freshener, sort of. And there's boo-boo. It's actually not air freshener. You know what it is? It's linen spray for your bed. It's lavender, so right before you go to bed. Or in the mornings, you spray your linen and it smells divine. See? It's called boo-boo air freshener. No, the air freshener we spray. Anyways, when you spray that in the car, it just, it smells divine. Wait, that means you're going to fall asleep in the car? Why do, you, why do you have mom's keys? Because she's turning on the car. Oh, so we can get cold now? Well, we have to also move the seats now that I scrubbed yeah. inside the seats. Like, recline it so we can get in those little cracks again. In the back? Mm -hmm. Oh. Of course, the seats have to be perfectly lined up at the end. There they are. Yeah, they're all the way forward, and no one wants to sit like that. No. Oh, I put the rugs when we started. I put the rugs in the washer. That's the kit that I used, that we used to detail this entire car. It pretty much has everything. And it had that little um tree, that smelly scent thing. Yeah, the... And the napkins and the rags. and So pretty much it covered it all. And I just keep it in the, my back trunk in case 
A, someone spills something, or B, I need I need something real quick. You can really tell how shiny and clean the car looks with the leather conditioner and the wax. I can't believe how nice it looks. And I used um, the rugs look good because I threw them in the washer yeah. and then I let them um, dry in the sun. I didn't put them in the dryer, but I just threw them outside and they dried in the sun. Now we had to fix the seat, so I was just turning on the car. You got good at that. It's so shiny. Mm -hmm. Look at that. It looks like it looks clean when you wash it, but with the wax, it's another level. Yeah. The rims are so shiny. They no longer look like hubcaps. They look like rims. You could see the reflection of all the clouds. Yep. Thanks for your help. You can really see how shiny it is. Like my nails now, when I scratch it, it's smooth. Yeah, that looks really nice. So that was a lot of work, but we got it done. Oh, we moved to the next car. Sammy's car. I love Sammy's car. It's so cute. I thought the the kit would be perfect gift for Sammy because this is her car. It's new to her. She got it herself. Yep, she just bought a new car. That's I love her car. Yeah. So the kit was perfect for her and the uh, Her car wasn't that dirty though. No, it wasn't that dirty, so it was important to keep it preserved. But here, we did the washing with the soap. And once we got it nice and clean, we cleaned the windows and sprayed the rims. And then once we did all that, we started the waxing. So that's where we're at right now. Did me and he help with this? No. No. Just me and Sammy. Sammy and I but that's okay because i wanted to show her how to use the wax how to use the sprays like what everything is for and then she can keep using this for the rest of the year or longer see how um we wax the top that's very important that you wax the top of the car don't forget about the top don't forget about the skirt don't forget about the sides i mean just do a little tiny piece at a time so it's not it's not a big deal Guys, I even wax her lights. Did, did we wax our lights? On yes. The car? Yes. On the BMW. We yes. did. I don't know if I mentioned it. I thought that was mommy's boy. All right, so I'm waxing the top. We're waxing the front, the sides, and little tiny pieces because it's really, really hot outside. I'm liking this angle. Yeah, they would go inside and take like five or 10 minute breaks. Yeah. You have to, it was just so hot. I know, it was like 90 degrees. When I went in that bath, it was so So once we did the waxing, um, I'm showing Sammy how to do the edges. See that? Just like we did on my car. I think we did this car the same day or the next day. It was the same day. So yeah, so here we are doing the edges. Oh, uh, look at look how nice that looks. Yeah. Ooh. Also, another thing you could do is turn the AC on in your car when you're doing it, and it helps you a little yeah. to stay cool if it's super hot out. Yeah. But you can only do that. Ooh, that's shiny. After you did the outside, because you can't yeah. wash the car while the while the engine's hot. Yeah. Or with the look doors open or anything. That is really sh shiny. How long did it take you to clean Sammy's car? Probably three hours, no, but it took a little bit shorter than that. Yeah. I just love that box. Look at the doors. See how we clean the um the doors just like on my car. All right. So now that we got the doors done and the outside done and the AC turned on, like you said. You put the same thing in Sammy's car. That little tree in our car, the Beamer. Yeah, because it's in the kit. There's two little trees. Yeah, she got her own kit. She needed her own kit for her car. 
Okay, so I'm cleaning the windows, the inside, because I already cleaned the outside windows. Where'd this come from? Oh. Hmm. Huh. the after. The after. All right, so right now Sammy's cleaning. She's not necessarily um, conditioning her leather yet. She's just cleaning, disinfecting it, taking off all the gunk. You can't tell because it's black, but believe me, her scrub was dirty. Yeah, so leather have... conditioner is like conditioner. You have to put shampoo on first. Yeah, you got to clean it first. So that's where the, um, the spray comes in. And somehow I used her little brush on some spots on her ceiling. I don't know what was up there. If you didn't know who Sammy is, it's her sister. All right, so pretty much... Now that Sammy's done cleaning um, all of the leather, she's going through with the leather conditioner and just working it in little pieces at a time, making sure to protect all of it. I like using this stuff on the couch too because it's not necessarily, it's for leather. It's for a new oven. Look. Wait, there's leather in cars? That's what the seats are. Oh, wait. I thought well, they were like leather plastic. or cloth and pleather. What's pleather? It's like fake leather. Oh. You can still use leather conditioner on it, though. Oh. I like Sammy's tattoo. All right, here's that spray. Oh, my gosh. I love that spray. I keep that one in the front. I should keep another bottle for the beds, but it just smells so good and yeah, we're always in the car. That's what the spray is for, the beds, your beds, but you could use it on the car and stuff like that. Also that spray, do not spray like directly on something, you just want to spray it in the air. There it is, guys. Why can we not spray directly on it? Cause you don't want to do that, it's for the air to make it smell good. Oh. Look how nice it looks though. Let's. Let's look at this car. Ooh, shiny! I shiny know. It is from the wax. Shiny. That stuff is serious, that wax. It looks yeah. like you photoshopped it, but you didn't. You can see every single reflection. The sun, the clouds, Here's everything trees. that we used on my car, Sammy's car. Here's my car looking bling bling and, and Sammy's some... car. These are on two separate Look days. at Oh, Sammy, here's what I got to say. Thanks for teaching me so much about life. And thanks for watching Inspiring Change. Thanks for watching Inspiring Bye. Change. Bye, Bye, guys. Ciao. If you want a kit, I'll put the link down below. Ciao. Si quiero ordenar un kit, voy a poner el link abajo. Hasta luego.